Welcome to Mindless Entertainment. My name is Jesse Milestone, and I feel like I'm being censored. <laughs> and as you guys may or may not know, I don't like that feeling. I don't like it when people tell me to calm down. I don't like it when people tell me to shut up. I don't like it when people tell me to change my words or the things I'm saying or the way I'm saying them or to fall in line. I don't exactly do that. So uh, screw you, YouTube. Because I don't appreciate you effing with my ad revenue over your opinions of what is and is not suitable. Because you're clearly wrong. Alright, so in the past week or so, a couple of weeks, I've had four different videos flagged on my channel as, uh, not flagged, but they're just, just marked as not suitable for all advertisers, right? So I, I requested manual reviews for all those. Those videos, just to give you a quick little breakdown, um, we had, uh, how is this offensive? which was my discussion of the newscaster who got fired for holding up uh, her word uh, mind teaser hang in there, which was the word there with the noose hanging from it, because apparently nooses are racist. Um, so she got fired over that, and I made a video about that one. Uh, I made um, uh, Now You Can Die, This Is Equality, or This Is What Equality Looks Like, which was about the fact that um, they're in discussions about uh, or some 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 judge made a declaratory ruling in Texas saying that basically if we have another draft you would have to draft women as well because otherwise it's sexist. Um, and and then I got flagged for my discussion of Green Book and my defense of Green Book is actually saying that I don't think this is a racist movie. I think it's actually a phenomenal movie that does a wonderful job about discussing race relations. Uh, and then I made a f uh, one just the other day discussing uh, the amazing guy who uh, infiltrated a hate group and dismantled them from the inside. Uh, and then compared that to Brie Larson's idea of how she's making change. Of these four videos, two were put into, yep, yeah, suitable for all advertisers, hooray. Two were listed as, nope, nope, definitely not suitable for all advertisers. Guess which ones? <laughs> Guess! All right, if you guess that the ones that were marked suitable were uh, my epic and psychotic rant about nooses being racist or not, uh, and my discussion of how true equality means women can now go die in the military just the same as men, uh, you're right. And the ones that were deemed not suitable were discussing how I liked Green Book and didn't think it was problematic, uh, and how I think that this guy who who is dismantling hate groups is awesome and better at making change than Brie Larson. Uh, I, of those, of those three videos, I think one is maybe not suitable for all advertisers. And of those, that one is one of the ones they marked as suitable. It's the, it's the, the hangman noose one. I was keen up on that one. And I said some interesting things like we should get rid of all of our gas ovens because if nooses are racist because they have been used for lynchings, well, gas ovens have been used to exterminate Jews. So throw all your ovens out the window, get rid of your ovens. I feel like that's a kind of psychotic thing to say. I think that there's a level of intense satire uh, and sarcasm in that video that kind of makes it a little bit on that, in that like edgy vein where maybe not everybody, not everybody advertiser wants to be affiliated with that kind of message. Uh, also, like, that thumbnail just has the word racist in it, like, 12 times. Uh, that's, that thumbnail is just me having posted the word racist all over everything. So, like, I don't, I don't get how that, how someone looked at that one and was like, yeah, this one's fine. And then was like, wait, this chick liked the movie that won Best Picture? Uh, fuck that video. Like, there's nothing... I mean, the most insulting thing I do is say that I think Justin Chang is stupid for his review of it. Um... And I posted that and called out Justin Chang on Twitter and Justin Chang responded and was like, you don't have to apologize for us having a difference of opinions. So I'm like, that's, I mean, clearly I was not offensive to Justin Chang. Uh, was I, who was I? I was offending woke culture pretty much only. These, but the two videos just offending, I mean, all the videos were offending woke, but this, these in particular were defending a film that others have said is problematic or racist. Um, and uh, discussing... Really, I mean, I don't. This is a news story. The guy who who uh, who dismantled a, 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 a somebody's holdings in the Klan and then dismantled the uh, National Socialist Movement, which is a Nazi party. Uh, this is a wonderful news story about a guy doing great things and then discussing how Brie Larson thinks that she's undergone trauma because she, her parents got a divorce when she was seven. Like, I don't understand what in this video is like. I've said more inflammatory things about Brie Larson in many many other Captain Marvel videos uh, that I've made so far. So I don't. I just, it's a little odd to me. 
You know, I just don't understand. Maybe two of those videos were reviewed by normal people and two were reviewed by super woke people. It was just really interesting to me that the ones that are more mainstream pop culture discussions, even though it's, again, same thematic general ideas, but two are more based in uh, local news stories, whereas two are based in the pop culture Hollywood discussion of the same things. And those two are the ones that are getting flagged. So anyway, watch out, guys. Uh, watch yourselves, watch your back, see if this nonsense is happening to you out there, because I do not accept this. I will not be told what I am and am not allowed to say about, about my culture and about my feelings regarding other, other, the world and other people's opinions. That's, that is not, that is not what YouTube is for. It is not to drive those narratives. And you say, oh, it's not a big deal. It's just because this is not suitable for all advertisers. That's not step one, guys. That's step one. And what that's saying already is hmm, you might want to think about the kinds of videos you make because these won't get monetized. You won't make any money off of these. Well, guess what? I will figure out other ways to make money. You ain't going to stop me from making the kind of videos I want to make, YouTube. So nice try. You lose. <sighs> that's it. Um, so if you guys enjoyed this video, oppress that like button because that's what we do. Maybe they just clicked to this one part of the video on those two and they're like, she said oppress the like button. I don't think we're okay with this. I think that's offensive. Anyway, oppress the like button because we like oppression here. And uh, like, drop your comments below. Share this video. All the interaction you have with this video helps this channel out so much. Uh, click that video that's popping up. Get involved with me if you want to see, find all the links, learn so much more about my social media, my Patreon, uh, my business addresses, my t-shirts, all of that stuff. It's all right there. So click on that if you want to stay more involved with the channel and continue to help it grow. Thanks so much, guys. We'll talk soon.